it's been an incredibly, incredibly tough uh, year with uh, the COVID and, uh, you know, we, it's kind of been a, a building block and that's kind of how I've told it to our guys. We started off, we couldn't have balls, we were outside, then we got balls and we were outside, then we got into the gym with balls and then we could go live. So it's just been kind of a progression. They haven't let the speed bumps uh, impact them mentally. They've been there, they've continued to fight. Yes, we've had some days where it's been a grind, but we've continued to get better, continued to learn. As a team, we're very resilient given our circumstances, uh, not being able to practice for as long as we've been out. Once we were able to get in the gym, that's when we started to see things turning around, things were moving forward. I think all the returners that we have, it'll be a strong core. And I think all the new guys that we have are gonna fit right in. I'm, I'm certainly approaching with a, with a winning attitude. I want to win this season and I was put into work all summer long and now it's gonna be time to step it up and connect all, all the pieces along with my teammates and try to uh, make it as far as we can uh, down the road. And, yeah, that, that's certainly, I'm going to be approaching with the winning mentality. i say for me, it's definitely just being able to fact that we get the hoop again, being around the team when we had those two practices and whatnot. And even like the month and a half we we're outside, it's just, you can kind of tell we have a good group. It's all about like binding and winning. And I feel like that, that just has like a nice winning culture too. It's just, I'm just, I like, I like to have fun in this too. We have a, a core group of six guys that uh, know what to expect and they've taken those other guys and kind of melded them into the program. I think that their leadership by example and how they do things will translate over. And that's what we're, what I you know, want to do for our program is create that foundation where going forward, this is what is expected um, versus just playing hard every day is something that we have to do. As far as the mindset, I would say it's the same. Our mindset is always to win, to come out on top, no matter who we're playing, how many games we're playing, how long we haven't practiced. I think individually, our mindsets have all uh, gone to another tier. I think everyone being away from practice, not being able to be around the team, I think we've all taken steps in our own direction. And to making sure that we are prepared and ready to, to congregate with one another once we are able to get back in the gym, I think we all made sure that we were ready for the moment that we will be able to get this thing uh, so we could hit, hit the ground running. As like a collective unit, and despite like, us not really being able to practice or whatnot, I think we're all pretty much going to be ready to come out and play and try to compete as hard as we can. We've talked about this, you know, you have to come like this is your last day playing basketball because you could very well be in this situation. And that's a mentality you have to have every single day, bring it, sell out, give it your all. And then obviously the sacrifice is off the court and our guys have done a phenomenal job with that. It's got to be incredibly hard to be able to give up on the traditional college life to sacrifice for basketball. But those are the things that will allow us to reach our ultimate goal as well as getting better day after day.